Meanwhile, the Senate has expressed regrets over the death of over 100 people who were burned to death while scooping fuel from a fallen truck near Dutse, the Jigawa state capital. They called on Ministry of Humanitarian Affairs and National Emergency Management Agency to provide relief materials to surviving victims of the explosion. National Orientation Agency was also tasked to carry out adequate sensitization on the dangers of scooping fuel from fallen trucks. The upper legislative chamber reached these resolutions today after a debate on a motion sponsored by Senator representing Jigawa North, Babengida Husseini. The president in the Senate is to note that on the night of 15th October yesterday, a tanker fully loaded with petroleum motor spirit, PMS, called Petrol, exploded along Hadeji Expressway in Majia town, located in the local government of Jigawa State, which is about 117 kilometers northeast of Dusi, the state capital. Also notes that this catastrophic inferno occurred around 10 p.m. when the residents of the area trooped out a mass to the accident scene to scoop fuel from the ill-fated tanker. And while this was on, the tanker exploded, resulting in massive fire which was quite difficult to control by the available facilities in the area. Father notes that the explosion resulted in the death of about 100 people whose bodies were burnt beyond recognition, leaving about 300 people with varying degrees of burns and are currently receiving treatments in Burnunkudu Federal Medical Center, General Hospital Rengim, General Hospital Hadija, and Jaun General Hospital. President of the Senate, Senator Godzilla Akmabio, warned citizens on the dangers of scooping fuel when such accidents occur. That God will grant solace to the families of those who lost their loved ones, and then, of course, uh, 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 Ajana Fidar to those who, are, who have departed. And uh, I want to also pray that those in hospitals will also uh, survive. However, I think we should also call on the state government. Uh, to take proactive steps to save more lives. But uh, may we rise for one minute silence in the honor. <laughs> 